Hey guys, my name is Eric Creel and welcome to the Creel Studios. And here's a brand new episode of Why I Won't Rant On. So, if you don't know where it is, this is a session of Why I Won't Rant on a certain movie, anime, TV show, YouTuber, video games, songs, and what have you. After I watch Lambarock Strikes Back, his rant on Disney's Pinocchio live-action remake, all I gotta say is... Lambarock Strikes Back and Frozen 2 fanboys Faustin 4 is right. This movie is nothing but a disappointment. So, here's my why I won't rant on the latest film that is directed by Robert Zemeckis. Which is later on with the directors of Cast Away, The Polar Express, Who Framed Roger Rabbit, Monster House, and last but certainly not least, Back to the Future. And that is Disney's live action remake, Pinocchio, which is this year. So, for the plot, we have Geppetto who wants to create Pinocchio, and then suddenly, when the Blue Fairy makes a wish for Pinocchio, and then suddenly, soon as Pinocchio, including with Jiminy Cricket, later on, when Pinocchio has to go to school, and then suddenly, and to meet with Honest John, and then suddenly, when Pinocchio wants to go to Pleasure Island, and then suddenly, when Pinocchio saves Geppetto, and then Pinocchio wants to become a real boy, at the end, and that's basically the plot for the entire film. So, which is the same things like the original 1940 classic animated movie called Pinocchio, but done wrong. So, don't get me wrong, I really adore the 1940 animated classic, which is Pinocchio, which is the Walt Disney's animated classic feature. So, I heard they announced about the Robert Zemeckis making a Disney's Pinocchio live-action remake, I said to myself, oh wow, this could have potential to be a fun live-action remake. And then the trailers were announced. These are awesome, in my opinion. So, on September 8th, 2022, which is Disney Plus Day, so... After I watched Frozen 2 Fanboy 2004's review on Pinocchio live action remake by Disney, and he called it one of the most disappointing movies from 2022. Oh. But, however, I just watched Cars on the Road on Disney Plus and Frozen 2 sing along version on Disney Plus. That's a pretty much a good thing. So. And you know what's the good things rather than Pinocchio live action remake from Disney? I have to say, thank goodness I watch Cars on the Road on Disney Plus and Frozen 2 sing-along version on Disney Plus instead of Disney's live action Pinocchio remake. I'm so happy it was a great choices two of the times. So... Let's take a look at the story. The story is pretty much like the same things like the 1940s animated classic, but done bad. Well, I'll do admit, the designs of Pinocchio himself, like he's a wooden puppet. He looks um, pretty good. Well, although it's not as good as the 2020s design of Sonic himself from Sonic the Hedgehog live action movie, but he's a pretty good looking design. And the characters, yeah, let's get into the characters. We have Tom Hanks, who performed as Geppetto. I gotta be honest, Tom Hanks is now officially, no, no, not just say that. Let me repeat myself one more time. Geppetto is now officially my least favorite Tom Hanks performance I've ever had. So who agrees the conductor from the Polar Express Woody from the Toy Story movies, and of course, the main character from Castaway are way better than Geppetto from Disney's Pinocchio live action remake. So, and 
including the songs. The songs we have no strings on me. So even though I haven't hear about that song, which is compared to the 1940s animated classic, which is a musical, well, it looks pretty interesting about it. So, and that's it. So after this movie came out on Disney Plus 10 days ago, yeah, this is when Disney live action remakes are starting to go flush down the drain of the toilet. After Disney's live action Pinocchio remake, and even my worst movie ever, the Dumbo live action remake, you know, directed by Tim Burton. So, yeah, I'm good with this one, since I'm not going to watch Disney's live action Pinocchio remake, which is I'm good. I'm saving by watching Pinocchio's stop motion animated features coming on Netflix this year, which I'm really looking forward to, and this is going to be even better than this. So, and that's my video of why I won't rant on Disney's live action Pinocchio remake. Tell me what do you think of my video, so let me know in the comments. And stay tuned for more episodes of why I won't rant on if you want to request me to do. So, that's it. If you want to see more videos to my channel, click subscribe, click the bell button if you want to see more messages, notifications, whatever you want. Thanks for watching, and until next time, goodbye.